What's up, all you gamers? It's Criteria Gamer, and we are back playing some more Timber and Stone. Today, today we're hoping to get at least two more migrants, and how I'm going to go about that is assigning everybody back to Farmer. Uh, because, well, essentially, well, first, let me just say this. I need uh, copper for another food barrel uh, because otherwise I won't be able to accomplish today's goal which would suck so I, I really want to uh, accomplish today's goal where is our blacksmith we have a new blacksmith uh, as you guys saw in last episode it's not Ismay Celeste you ain't got no arrows you don't have any arrows hmm alright we'll get to work on that let's uh let's figure out oh there she is Christina good old Christina why have you not started on the copper ingots do you need tongs or something no you're, you're fine on tongs why I don't get it. Why have you not started making them? Hmm? Do you have a good answer? No? Yes or no? Oh, because you were set to carpenter. Oh, okay. I couldn't tell. Her name is too dang long. We're going to change her name. Chevilio. Christina. That's fine. Christina the blacksmith. Blacksmith. Arthur is a carpenter. Samantha is infantry. What are you making exactly? Oh, okay. Copper arrows. Dang it. No, that copper. Oh, you idiot. You stupid idiot. Oh, my gosh. That copper was meant for the, um, the what you call it. The, uh, oh, man, I can't think of it. The food barrel. Good gosh. Come on now. Come on, Criteria. Okay, there's a copper ore right there. <laughs> Cheat the system. Ah, found a loophole. Let's see. There's some tin. Tin is always good. I'll take tin all day. All day er day. Now let's see. Is there any more copper? There's some more tin. We'll go ahead and get him started on that. I don't see any more copper though. Um, copper, 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 copper. Just trying to scan that right quick. Do a little quick scan job on this. I don't see any more. Is that 10? We'll pass on that. It's too far out. Unless there's some copper over here. Some copper over here? Nah, there's not. Well, dang. Um, somebody, you know, guys, you get on to me for this, but oh well. Um, somebody in the comments was mentioning about a quarry, how I should have a quarry set up. And I think that's a brilliant idea. Uh, now going about that is what's going to be difficult. Because, well, I'm not at, in, in the best position for, for one right now. But, um... That's okay. I think we can push through it. So he is. Did your pickaxe break? What is. What's the deal here? What's the deal, yo? No, you're fine. Okay. Do we have copper now? That's the question. Yes, we do. We have enough to make one more. Okay. Alright. So Christina's going to get to working on the copper ingot. And with that copper ingot, we are going to make yet another food barrel the food barrel is going to give us uh, enough storage to hopefully get a few more migrants in here uh, because the the food barrel allows us to get uh, a higher uh, max quantity for food and right now our max is for uh, 140 and we are at uh, 177 but it's 
for some reason I don't know what's up with that the whole storage uh, to seed thing I don't know why the the max is, is much lower than uh, what I have over there uh, list on the left um, also another thing I noticed my mouse cursor is hidden uh, due to the program I record with um, which it would be too much of, of a pain for me to just take it off every single time I record Minecraft and then stuff like that just other games that require uh, the, the mouse to be on screen it's just it's too much it's, it's too hard to do every single time because um, you have to go and, and redo the settings every time I'm not saying I'm lazy but I just don't feel like doing it every single time so you are useless right now so let's put you on farmer you are going back on farmer because there's nothing to do oh that's Arthur he should be on farming anyway because he's a boss you don't have any um, arrows I don't believe you have one arrow you are a failure at life okay all right so we have what's his face Kurt good old Kurt J Mac working <laughs> oh that's so gonna be his name oh man good old Kurt Kurt J Mac <laughs> oh that's awesome um, <laughs> good old Kurt um, so yeah we have Kurt mining we have Ismay <laughs> Ismay um, so we have her mining as well so the quarry is coming along just nicely I was also uh, asked to remove the red notifications as they come so that way when a trader does show up we will know about it right away because it will be in red text and I will look at that every single time so um, okay it, did you did you get a new one or no you didn't great um, let's see can we make oh yeah let's just make you a steel one yeah alright uh, where is she? What? Christina. I almost called her Christian. <laughs> Alright, put you on blacksmithing again. Add two logs. And, yes, one does not simply farm without a hoe. I know. That's why I made you one. Now calm them. Calm them. Alright, so... Samantha is taking a nap. Go ahead and get rid of that red notification. We should have more food coming in pretty shortly. Um, my thing is, how soon? Because I don't want this episode to run on that long. Because you guys do know I record at night, and the later it is, the worse my commentary is. So, just want you guys to have a good viewing experience. We're gonna make a bunch of these. Let's go ahead and do 10. Christina, put you back on Carpenter. Or put you on Carpenter. This is our first time being on Carpenter for us, I believe. So, she's working on that. These guys are farming just nicely. Look at that. Arthur collects one carrot seed, harvests four food. Oh, yeah. Way to go, Arthur. Use a boss. And I think, yeah, Christina fell asleep. She's like, peace out. And, oh, Arthur, man. He, he is just raking in the food. I'm telling you, Arthur is a boss. He's a boss. He knows what he's doing. He has done this for many years. Many. Actually, he's only been at it for like seven days. <laughs> and yeah he's a boss now you we are you know what let's just leave that because what we'll probably end up doing is just connecting all this Ooh, hello kappa I love me some kappa 
All right, so how this quarry is going to work is just going to be just like that. Oh, -ho. Uh, and they're gonna use, let's see, actually, dig that out as well. They're gonna just use one one block as a step to get all the way down. What's up with this? Oh, okay. Good, good, good. I thought that goblin was alive or something. You are. Are you in danger of getting killed? No, I don't think so. Um, so yeah, hopefully the quarry will bring in a lot of ores that we can use to make armor and uh, weaponry for everybody. Because everybody right now, I don't think, I don't think everybody has a sword that they can just use as they please. No, and you, no, you don't have one. I th it's one of these farmers I think has one yeah I think it's him why do you have five arrows oh because you were uh, infantry let's go ahead you are gonna get rid of your arrows because you're gonna be a farmer from now on because I said so uh, well for the meantime that is anyway and that needs to be rebuilt um, in the future not, not right now though, because I don't have all the resources uh, necessary. I do, but I don't feel like using them at the moment because I have other plans for them. Now, the hard part about this is I want to have a dedicated area for farming. So what I'm thinking is like an area like this, like this, this room right here. I have to show you guys with the zoom in and zoom out because you guys can't see my mouse cursor so um, but yeah here it is um, what I'm thinking is having an area like this like this size without the the center walls and then having it expanded out to like right there or something and having the whole thing nothing but farmland and then they can really really get to work um, so also another thing I have not uh, looked up whether or not you can get horses in this game or not but the game sure didn't imply that so I don't know what's the dealio with that but I will be sure to check it out um, probably after I get done recording this so I have to edit and everything like that um, I was also told to start going to bed earlier uh, to get more sleep. <laughs> uh, what I think I'm going to start doing is incorporating naps into my day. So that way I can have like a power nap or whatever. And uh, then I'll be good for the rest of the night. Because the way things work in this household are, uh, you know, everybody's working. Well, not everybody's working during the day. But, um, you know, some people are home during the day. And, you know, some people aren't. And things like that. It's just really busy in this house so uh, that's it is what it is why are you mining that I don't I don't get that I didn't set uh, did I I don't know I don't know why he's digging out the wall but okay I guess I highlighted it uh, so the food supply is going up which is good it's very good and I tell you what we're gonna set everybody a farmer we have to. We gotta. We gotta do it. We we need we need hose though. Uh, Christina, wake up. You also wake up. Help her with the carpentry. Let's see. Can we get one more person on carpentry? There we go. Get those hose made pretty fast. Let's see how fast. And yeah, okay. Yes, that's that's not too bad. Um Yeah. Yeah, that's fine. We can deal with this. Um, okay. Enough saying um. That is dirt. That has to go. That's just annoying. That's that's been there for like three episodes and it's kinda making making me mad. And I'm surprised nobody has commented about that yet. <laughs> so I think, I think I'm gonna uh, let this run on for a little bit. And uh, I think I'm gonna go ahead and call this an episode. Like I said, I don't want this episode to run on too long. 
and I'm trying to keep these episodes under 20 minutes, which is this one's probably going to be like 10 minutes long. But uh, yeah, that's that's the deal with that. And they're they're just gonna they're just gonna farm away. So let's see, can I get a good picture of them farming? Maybe. Let's see. Come on, good picture here. Give me a good picture. All right there. Three, two, one, and cheese. Oh yeah. All right, so get rid of the red notifications. And I think I'm gonna go ahead and call this an episode. So I just want to thank everyone so much for watching and supporting. <gasps> oh, yay! <laughs> uh, before we end this episode, we have a special guest. Their name is Alden. Alden? I think it's Alden. Yeah, Alden. Uh, they are terrible at everything, but they have a strong back, so that is good. Uh, they are bringing two food, one rope, and one wooden log. Let's put them on, hmm, I think, I think farmer. You don't go anywhere. You're going to be a farmer. Okay, so before I was interrupted by Alden, or whatever the heck his name is. Uh, yeah, I think I'm going to go ahead and wrap up this video. I just want to thank you guys so much, uh, as always, for watching. And you, oh man, you're rocking that new wooden buckler. Look at that. Oh yeah. That is awesome. Amazing. Looking like a real guard. Awesome. So yeah, I will see you all in the next episode or video. Your choice. See you guys next time. Thanks again for watching. Have a good day.